In linguistics, a compound is a lexeme less precisely, a word that consists of more than one stem. Compounding, composition or nominal composition is the process of word formation that creates compound lexemes. That is, in familiar terms, compounding occurs when two or more words are joined to make one longer word. The meaning of the compound may be similar to or different from the meanings of its components in isolation. The component stems of a compound may be of the same part of speech, as in the case of the English word footpath, composed of the two nouns foot and path, or they may belong to different parts of speech, as in the case of the English word blackbird, composed of the adjective black and the noun bird. With very few exceptions, English compound words are stressed on their first component stem. The process occurs readily in other Germanic languages for different reasons. Words can be concatenated both to mean the same as the sum of two words e.g. Presseconference German for press conference or where an adjective and noun are compounded e.g. Havidvensglas Danish for white wine glass. The addition of affix morphemes to words such as suffixes or prefixes, as in employ employment should not be confused with nominal composition, as this is actually morphological derivation. Some languages easily form compounds from what in other languages would be a multi-word expression. This can result in unusually long words, a phenomenon known in German which is one such language as bandwormorder or tapeworm words. Topic. Formation of compounds Compound formation rules vary widely across language types. In a synthetic language, the relationship between the elements of a compound may be marked with a case or other morpheme. For example, the German compound Kapitenspatent consists of the lexemes Kapiten see Captain and Patent license joined by an S originally a genitive case suffix, and similarly, the Latin lexeme Paterfamilias contains the archaic genitive form familias of the lexeme familia family. Conversely, in the Hebrew language compound, the word bayat sepe bet sefer school, it is the head that is modified. The compound literally means house of book, with bayat bayat house having entered the construct state to become bayat bet house of. This latter pattern is common throughout the Semitic languages, though in some it is combined with an explicit genitive case, so that both parts of the compound are marked, e.g., Arabic bidi al abdu al lahi, servant of God. Agglutinative languages tend to create very long words with derivational morphemes. Compounds may or may not require the use of derivational morphemes also. The longest compounds in the world may be found in the Finnic and Germanic languages. In German, extremely extendable compound words can be found in the language of chemical compounds, where, in the cases of biochemistry and polymers, they can be practically unlimited in length, mostly because the German rule suggests combining all noun adjuncts with the noun as the very last stem. German examples include Farbfernsehgerät, color television set, Funkfernbedienung, radio remote control, and the often quoted jocular word Donnerdumpfschifffahrtsgesellschaftskapitensmutz, originally only two Fs, Danube Steamboat Shipping Company Captain S hat, which can of course be made even longer and even more absurd, e.g. Donadump Schiffarts Gesellschaftskapitensmutzenreinigungsoschreibungsverordnungsdiskussionsanfang. Beginning of the discussion of a regulation on tendering of Danube Steamboat Shipping Company Captain Hats, etc. According to several editions of the Guinness Book of World Records, the longest published German has 79 letters and is Donadump Schiffarts Elektrizitatenhauptbetriebswerkbauunterbeamtengesellschaft. Association for Subordinate Officials of the Main Electric ITY Maintenance Building of the Danube Steam Shipping. But there is no evidence that this association ever actually existed. 
The word is so absurd that it was obviously invented as a joke, which is emphasized by the illogical use of the plural of electricity. In Finnish, although there is theoretically no limit to the length of compound words, words consisting of more than three components are rare. Even those with less than three components can look mysterious to non-Finnish such as hataloskainti emergency exit. Internet folklore sometimes suggests that lentokwansukaturbianimutori apumakainikoliupsiriopilas airplane jet turbine engine auxiliary mechanic non-commissioned officer student is the longest word in Finnish, but evidence of it actually being used is scant and anecdotal at best. Compounds can be rather long when translating technical documents from English to some other language, since the lengths of the words are theoretically unlimited, especially in chemical terms terminology. For example, when translating an English technical document to Swedish, the term, "...motion estimation search range settings", can be directly translated to Rorelseopskattingsekintervalsinstallingar, though in reality, the word would most likely be divided in two, so kintervalsinstallingar for Rorelseopskatting, "...search range settings for motion estimation." Topic Subclasses Topic Semantic Classification A common semantic classification of compounds yields four types Endocentric Exocentric Copulative Appositional on endocentric compound consists of a head, i.e. the categorical part that contains the basic meaning of the whole compound, and modifiers, which restrict this meaning. For example, the English compound doghouse, where house is the head and dog is the modifier, is understood as a house intended for a dog. Endocentric compounds tend to be of the same part of speech word class as their head, as in the case of doghouse, such compounds were called titpurusa in the Sanskrit tradition. An exocentric compound called a bahuvrihi compound in the Sanskrit tradition is a hyponym of some unexpressed semantic category such as a person, plant, or animal. None neither of its components can be perceived as a formal head, and its meaning often cannot be transparently guessed from its constituent parts. For example, the English compound white collar is neither a kind of collar nor a white thing. In an exocentric compound, the word class is determined lexically, disregarding the class of the constituents. For example, a must-have is not a verb but a noun. The meaning of this type of compound can be glossed as one whose b is a, where b is the second element of the compound and a the first. A bahuvrihi compound is one whose nature is expressed by neither of the words, thus a white-collar person is neither white nor a collar the collar's color is a metonym for socio-economic status. Other English examples include barefoot. Copulative compounds are compounds with two semantic heads. Appositional compounds are lexemes that have two contrary attributes that classify the compound. Topic. Syntactic classification Noun-noun compounds All natural languages have compound nouns. The positioning of the words i.e. the most common order of constituents in phrases where nouns are modified by adjectives, by possessors, by other nouns, etc. varies according to the language. While Germanic languages, for example, are left branching when it comes to noun phrases the modifiers come before the head, the Romance languages are usually right branching. In French, compound nouns are often formed by left-hand heads with prepositional components inserted before the modifier, as in chemin de fer railway, lit. road of iron, and moulin event, windmill, lit. 
mill, that works by means of wind. In Turkish, one way of forming compound nouns is as follows: Yeldgermeni (windmill), Yel (wind), Degerman I (mill possessive), Demiryolu (railway), Demir (iron), Yal U (road possessive). Topic: <laughs> Verb noun compounds. A type of compound that is fairly common in the Indo-European languages is formed of a verb and its object, and in effect transforms a simple verbal clause into a noun. In Spanish, for example, such compounds consist of a verb conjugated for the second person singular imperative followed by a noun singular or plural, e.g., rascacielos modeled on skyscraper, lit. Scratch skies, sacacorchos, corkscrew, lit. Pull corks, garderopa, wardrobe, lit. Store clothes. These compounds are formally invariable in the plural, but in many cases they have been reanalyzed as plural forms, and a singular form has appeared. French and Italian have these same compounds with the noun in the singular form, Italian grattacielo, skyscraper, French grill pane, toaster lit, toast bread. This construction exists in English, generally with the verb and noun both in uninflected form, examples are spoilsport, killjoy, breakfast, cutthroat, pickpocket, dreadnought, and know nothing. Also common in English is another type of verb noun or noun verb compound, in which an argument of the verb is incorporated into the verb, which is then usually turned into a gerund, such as breastfeeding, finger pointing, etc. The noun is often an instrumental complement. From these gerunds new verbs can be made, a mother breastfeeds a child and from them new compounds mother-child breastfeeding, etc. In the Australian Aboriginal language Jingulu, a Pama Nyungan language, it is claimed that all verbs are V plus N compounds, such as do a sleep or run a dive, and the language has only three basic verbs do, make, and run. A special kind of compounding is incorporation, of which noun incorporation into a verbal root, as in English backstabbing, breastfeed, etc., is most prevalent. See below. Topic. Verb verb compounds Verb verb compounds are sequences of more than one verb acting together to determine clause structure. They have two types. In a serial verb, two actions, often sequential, are expressed in a single clause. For example, u ter dzo, lit. Turn leave, means turn and leave and Hindi jakara deko ya kar dekho, lit. Go conjunctive participle see imperative, means, go and see. In Tamil, a Dravidian language, van, t, u pa r, lit. Come see. In each case, the two verbs together determine the semantics and argument structure. Serial verb expressions in English may include what did you go and do that for, or he just upped and left. This is however not quite a true compound since they are connected by a conjunction and the second missing arguments may be taken as a case of ellipsis. In a compound verb or complex predicate, one of the verbs is the primary, and determines the primary semantics and also the argument structure. The secondary verb, often called a vector verb or explicator, provides fine distinctions, usually in temporality or aspect, and also carries the inflection tense and or agreement markers. The main verb usually appears in conjunctive participial sometimes zero form. For examples, Hindi Nikala Gaya Nikal Gaya, lit. Exit went, means went out, while Nikala Para Nikal Para, lit. Exit fell, means departed or was blurted out. In these examples Nikala Nikal is the primary verb, and Gaya Gaya and Para Para are the vector verbs. Similarly, in both English start reading and Japanese do mi shi meru yomihajimeru. Read conjunctive start. Start reading. 
the vector verbs start and shimeru hajimeru start change according to tense, negation, and the like, while the main verbs reading and do me yomi reading", usually remain the same. An exception to this is the passive voice, in which both English and Japanese modify the main verb, i.e. start to be read and do mer shi meru yomari haji meru lit. Read passive, conjunctive, start. Start to be read. With a few exceptions all compound verbs alternate with their simple counterparts. That is, removing the vector does not affect grammaticality at all nor the meaning very much. Nikala Nikala he went out. In a few languages, both components of the compound verb can be finite forms. Kuru keccr ker r lit. Died three place went three place. They died. Compound verbs are very common in some languages, such as the northern Indo-Aryan languages Hindustani and Punjabi, and Dravidian languages like Tamil, where as many as 20% of verb forms in running text are compound. They exist but are less common in other Indo-Aryan languages like Marathi and Nepali, in Tibeto-Burman languages like Limba and Nawari, in Turkic languages like Turkish and Kyrgyz, in Korean and Japanese, and in Northeast Caucasian languages like Tsez and Avar. Under the influence of a Quechua substrate speakers living in the Ecuadorian Altiplano have innovated compound verbs in Spanish, de rabia puso rompiendo la ala, in anger he, she, smashed the pot, lit, from anger put breaking the pot. Botaremos matandote, we will kill you, cf. Quechua wanyuchi shpa shitashin, lit. Kill cp throw point one plfut. Likewise in Hindi, Tere ko mara dalange Tere ko mar dalange, lit. We will kill throw you. Compound verb equivalents in English examples from the internet, what did you go and do that for? If you are not giving away free information on your website then a huge proportion of your business is just upping and leaving. Big Pig, she took and built herself a house out of brush. Caution, in descriptions of Persian and other Iranian languages, the term compound verb refers to noun plus verb compounds, not to the verb verb compounds discussed here. Topic. Compound adpositions Compound prepositions formed by prepositions and nouns are common in English and the Romance languages consider English on top of, Spanish encima de, etc. Hindi has a small number of simple i.e., one word postpositions and a large number of compound postpositions, mostly consisting of simple postposition k followed by a specific postposition e.g., k pa, near, k niche, underneath. Topic. Examples from different languages Chinese traditional, simplified Chinese, standard Chinese pinyin, Cantonese jit ping. Shui Sheng Shui Sheng student, Shui Shui, HOK 6 learn plus Sheng Sheng, Sang 1 living being Tai Kong Tai Kong space, Tai Tai, Tai 3 great plus Kong Kong, Hung 1 emptiness Motien Lu Motien Lu Skyscraper, Mo Mo, Mo 1 Touch plus Tien Tien, Tin 1 Sky plus Lu Lu, Lao 2 Building, with more than one story. Da Yin Ji Da Yin Ji Printer, Da Da, DAA 2 Strike plus Yin Yin, Yan 3 Stamp, Print plus G G, Gay 1 Machine. By K Quan Shu, by K Quan Shu Encyclopedia, by by B A A K three thousand one hundred plus K K for one branch of study plus Quan Quan Cyan four entire complete plus Shu Shu S Y U one book. Xie 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 thanks. Repeating of Xie Xie thanks Dutch. Arbeid songeschikdeed's verzikering disability insurance arbeid labor plus ongeschikdeed inaptitude plus verzikering insurance 
Riol Water Zuiverings Installati, Wastewater Treatment Plant, Riol, Sewer, Plus Water, Water, Plus Zuivering, Cleaning, Plus Installati, Installation. Verjardis Calendar, Birthday Calendar, Verjardig, Birthday, Plus Calendar, Calendar. Clanton Service Metaworker, Customer Service Representative, Clanton Customers Plus Service Service Plus Metaworker Worker. Universitites Bibliotheque, University Library, Universitat University Plus Bibliotheque Library. Dorgria Magalakedan, Possibilities for Advancement, Door Through Plus Grow A Grow Plus Magalakedan, Possibilities. Finish. Sana Kirja Dictionary, Sana Word plus Kirja Book. Tiatakoni Computer, Tiato Knowledge Data plus Kone Machine. Keskaviko Wednesday, Keski Middle plus Viko Week. Melma World, Ma Land plus Ilma Air. Routa Railway Station, Routa Iron plus Tai Road plus Asima Station. Koma by Hekilowatt Electricity Meter, 3 phase kilowatt hour meter. Sukaderbi Aniapumaka Nikoli Upsiriopilas, Jet Engine Assistant Mechanic NCO Student. Automaton Energyrektor Generator Laudutahaderbi Inaratis by, literally, Atomic Nuclear Energy Reactor Generator Condenser Turbine Cogwheel Stage. German Woken Kratzer, Skyscraper, Woken, Clouds, Plus Kratzer, Scraper Eisen von, Railway, Eisen, Iron, Plus Bond, Track Kraft Fertog, Automobile, Kraft, Power, Plus Fahren, Far, Drive, Plus Zub, Machinery Stacheldraht, Barbed Wire, Stachel, Barb, Barbed, Plus Draht, Wire Reiner Kens H Nings und Rein Fleischetiket Erung Suberwechung Sokaben Übertragings Gesetz, literally cattle marking and beef labeling supervision duties, delegation la Wangshan Greek. Philosophus philosopher, Philos Philos, beloved, plus Sophia Sophia, wisdom. Democratia Democratia, democracy, demos demos, people, plus Kratos, rule. Rotodactylos, rotodactylos, rose fingered, rodin, rodin, rose plus dactylos, dactylos, finger, a Homeric epithet applied to the dawn, Icelandic. Jarnbraut, railway, jarn, iron, plus brought, path, or way. Ferrar takey, vehicle, ferrar, journey, plus takey, apparatus. Alfrey Orbach, Encyclopedia, Al, Everything, plus Frey, Study, or, Knowledge, plus Orbach, Dictionary, Ora, Words, plus Bach, Book. Simtal, Telephone Conversation, Sim, Telephone, plus Tall, Dialogue Italian. Millipede, Centipede, Mill, Thousand, plus PD, Feet. Ferrovia, Railway, Ferro, Iron, plus Via, Way. Terja Cristallo, windscreen wiper, terger, to wash, plus Cristallo, crystal, pane of glass Japanese. Mu Wei Mashi Shiji Mezumashi, Doke, alarm clock, Mu Mi, I, plus Wei Mashi Samashi, Zamashi, awakening, someone, plus Shiji Toke, Doke, clock. Oh how me shao ki okonomiyaki, oh how me okonomi, preference, plus shao ki yaki, cooking. Rigwe re higeri, day trip, re high, day, plus gwe re carry, gary, returning, home. Guo we yi shi tang kakai gijido, national diet building, guo we kakai, national diet, plus yi shi giji, proceedings, plus tang du, how Korean. Anpak anpak, inside and outside, and an inside plus back back outside, as two nouns compound the consonant sound b fortifies into p, becoming anpak anpak rather than in back anpak ojibwe anishinabemowin. Mashkiki wabu tonic, mashkiki medicine plus wabu liquid. Muskoman raspberry, misko red plus mean berry. Dibik Geetsis, Moon, Dibik, Night, plus Geetsis, Sun, Geechi Moakoman, White Person, American, Geechi, Big, plus Moakoman, Night Spanish, 
Ciencia Fisiome, Science Fiction, Ciencia, Science, plus Fisiome, Fiction, this word is a calc from the English expression science fiction. In English, the head of a compound word is the last morpheme, science fiction. Conversely, the Spanish head is located at the front, so ciencia ficción sounds like a kind of fictional science rather than scientific fiction. Sempies, centipede, cien, hundred, plus pies, feet. Ferro caro, railway, ferro, iron, plus caro, lane. Paraguas, umbrella, para, stops, plus aguas, the, water. Cabizbajo, keeping the head low in a bad mood, cabeza, head, plus bajo, down. Subibaja, seesaw, contraction of sub y baja, goes up and down. Limpia parabrisis, windshield wiper, is a nested compound, limpia, clean, plus parabrisis windshield, which is itself a compound of para, stop, plus brises, breezes, tamil, in Semazi, classical Tamil, rules for compounding are laid down in grammars such as Tolkapiam and Nanyal, in various forms, under the name Punarchi. Examples of compounds include Kapuram from ko, king, plus Purim exterior. Sometimes phonemes may be inserted during the blending process such as in Koval from ko, king, plus il, home. Other types are like veni butter from veli white plus nei gi. Note how veli becomes ven. In Kotuntamese, non-standard Tamil, parts of words from other languages may be morphed into Tamil. Common examples include rata azudam blood pressure from the Sanskrit rakta blood and semazi azudam pressure. Note how rakta becomes rata in Tamil order to remove the consonant cluster. This also happens with English, for examples kapi katai coffee shop is from English coffee, which becomes kapi in Tamil, and the Tamil katai meaning shop. Talicho yatsi, dogrib. Dilutes, peanut butter, dilu, squirrel, plus ts, dung. Aik, hospital, eya, sick, plus k, house. De gotli kerosene, de land, plus gotli, its fat. Do letta, vanic, do aboriginal, people, plus letta, bread. Topic: Germanic languages. In Germanic languages, including English, compounds are formed by prepending what is effectively a namespace, disambiguation context, to the main word. For example, football would be a ball in the foot context. In itself, this does not alter the meaning of the main word. The added context only makes it more precise. As such, a football must be understood as a ball. However, as is the case with football, a well-established compound word may have gained a special meaning in the language's vocabulary. Only this defines football as a particular type of ball unambiguously the round object, not the dance party, at that, and also the game involving such a ball. Another example of special and altered meaning is starfish. A starfish is in fact not a fish in modern biology. Also syntactically, the compound word behaves like the main word, the whole compound word or phrase inherits the word class and inflection rules of the main word. That is to say, since fish and shape are nouns, starfish and star shape must also be nouns, and they must take plural forms as starfish and star shapes. Definite singular forms as the starfish and the star shape, and so on. This principle also holds for languages that express definiteness by inflection, as in North Germanic. Because a compound is understood as a word in its own right, it may in turn be used in new compounds, so forming an arbitrarily long word is trivial. 
This contrasts to Romance languages, where prepositions are more used to specify word relationships instead of concatenating the words. As a member of the Germanic family of languages, English is unusual in that compounds are normally written in separate parts. This would be an error in other Germanic languages such as Norwegian, Swedish, Danish, German and Dutch. However, this is merely an orthographic convention, as in other Germanic languages, arbitrary noun phrases, for example, Girl Scout Troop, City Council Member, and Cellar Door, can be made up on the spot and used as compound nouns in speech, also in English. <laughs> Russian language In the Russian language compounding is a common type of word formation, and several types of compounds exist, both in terms of compounded parts of speech and of the way of the formation of a compound. Compound nouns may be agglutinative compounds, hyphenated compounds Stolniga folding table lit. Table book, i.e. book-like table, or abbreviated compounds acronyms, kolyoth kolkhoz. Some compounds look like acronym, while in fact they are an agglutinations of type stem plus word, akademgorodok akademgorodok from akademicheski gorodok academic village. In agglutinative compound nouns, an agglutinating infix is typically used, parahod steamship, par plus o plus hod. Compound nouns may be created as noun plus noun, adjective plus noun, noun plus adjective rare, noun plus verb or, rather, noun plus verbal noun. Compound adjectives may be formed either per se, e.g., bello rosavi white pink, or as a result of compounding during the derivation of an adjective from a multi-word term, Kamenustrovsky prospect came in and Strosk JPRSP Kate Stone Island Avenue, a street in St. Petersburg. Reduplication in Russian language is also a source of compounds. Quite a few Russian words are borrowed from other languages in an already compounded form, including numerous classical compounds or internationalisms, automobile, automobile. Topic: <laughs> Sanskrit language. Sanskrit is very rich in compound formation with seven major compound types and as many as 55 subtypes. The compound formation process is productive, so it is not possible to list all Sanskrit compounds in a dictionary. Compounds of two or three words are more frequent, but longer compounds with some running through pages are not rare in Sanskrit literature. Some examples are below hyphens below show individual word boundaries for ease of reading but are not required in original Sanskrit. Himalaya IAST Himalaya, decomposed as Hima Alaya, name of the Himalaya mountain range. Literally the abode of snow. A compound of two words and four syllables. Pravara Mukuta Mani Marisi Manyajari Kaya Karsita Karana Yugala Iast Pravara Mukuta Mani Marisi Manyajari Kaya Karsita Karana Yugala, literally, O oh the one whose dual feet are covered by the cluster of brilliant rays from the gems of the best crowns, from the Sanskrit work Panchatantra. A compound of nine words and twenty-five syllables. Kamala Kuka Kunkuma Pinharikarta Vaksastala Virahita Maha Kastaba Mani Marisi Mala Narakarta Tri Bhavana Tamira Iast Kamala Kuka Kunkuma Pinharikarta Vaksastala Virahita Maha Kastaba Mani Marisi Mala Narakarta Tri Bhavana Tamira, literally O oh, the one who dispels the darkness of three worlds by the shine of Kastaba jewel hanging on the chest, which has been made reddish yellow by the saffron from the bosom of Kamala. Lakshmi an adjective of Rama in the Kakapushundi Ramayana. A compound of 16 words and 44 syllables. 
Sankhya Yoga Nyaya Vaisesika Purva Mimansa Vedanta Narada Sandalya Bhakti Sutra Gita Valmikya Ramayana Bhagavatati Siddhanta Bhada Pura Sara Samadakirtesiza Tulasi Dasa Sahitya Sauhitya Svadaya Pravakana Vyahayana Parama Pravina Iast Sankhya Yoga Nyaya Vaisesika Purva Mimamsa Vedanta Narada Sandilya Bhakti Sutra Gita Valmikya Ramayana Bhagavatati Siddhanta Bhada Pura Sara Samadakirtesiza Tulasi Dasa Asa Sahitya Sauhitya Svadaya Pravakana Vyahayana Parama Pravina, literally the acclaimed forerunner in understanding of the canons of Sankhya, Yoga, Nyaya, Vaisesika, Purva Mimamsa, Vedanta, Narada Bhakti Sutra, Sandilya Bhakti Sutra, Bhagavad Gita, the Ramayana of Valmiki, Srimadbhagavata, and the most skilled in comprehensive self study, discoursing and expounding of the complete works of Gosvami Tulasidasa. An adjective used in a panegyric of Jagadguru Rambhadracharya. The hyphens show only those word boundaries where there is no sandhi. On including word boundaries with sandhi, Vedanta equals Veda Anta, Ramayana equals Rama Ayana, Bhagavatadi equals Bhagavata Adi, Siddhanta equals Siddha Anta, Samadhikartesisa equals Samadhikarta Asesa, Svadaya equals Sva Adaya. This is a compound of 35 words and 86 syllables. Topic: Recent trends. Although there is no universally agreed upon guideline regarding the use of compound words in the English language, in recent decades written English has displayed a noticeable trend towards increased use of compounds. Recently, many words have been made by taking syllables of words and compounding them, such as pixel picture element and bit binary digit. This is called a syllabic abbreviation. In Dutch and the Scandinavian languages there is an unofficial trend towards splitting compound words, known in Norwegian as serskriving, in Swedish as sarskrivning literally, separate writing, and in Dutch as Engels ziekte, the English disease, because the Scandinavian languages rely heavily on the distinction between the compound word and the sequence of the separate words it consists of, this has serious implications. For example, the adjective roikfrit literally smoke free, meaning no smoking allowed if separated into its composite parts would mean roikfrit smoke freely. In Dutch, compounds written with spaces may also be confused, but can also be interpreted as a sequence of a noun and a genitive, which is unmarked in Dutch in formal abbreviated writing. This may lead to, for example, commissie vergadering commission meeting being read as commission of the meeting rather than meeting of the commission normally spelled commissionvergadering the german spelling reform of 1996 introduced the option of hyphenating compound nouns when it enhances comprehensibility and readability this is done mostly with very long compound words by separating them into two or more smaller compounds, like Eisenbahn Unterführung (railway underpass) or Kraftfahrzeugs Betriebsanleitung (car manual). Such practice is also permitted in other Germanic languages, e.g., Danish and Norwegian, Bachmal and Nynorsk alike, and is even encouraged between parts of the word that have very different pronunciation, such as when one part is a loan word or an acronym. <laughs> <laughs> Compounding by language Classical compounds English compounds German compounds Sanskrit compounds Topic See also Compound modifier Bracketing paradox Genitive connector Incorporation linguistics Kenning Multiword expression Neologism Noun adjunct Portmanteau compounds 
status constructus word formation syllabic abbreviation tweebuffels meeting scootmores dojskiatfontein equals equals notes